Unitree Quadruped Robot A1 A Chinese robotic company known as Unitree has revealed a new robot dog. Like most dogs, this robot too has four legs and looks like a Boston Dynamic robot. You can get this robot dog if you happen to have $10,000 in pocket as it has already debuted in the 2020 Consumer Electronics Show. This dog is strong and can jump, flip, and travel 7 miles in an hour. The Unitree Quadruped Robot A1 has a strong motor and flexible joints, great for performance. The sensors in this robot are great for assisting in the decision-making process. It has a multi-eye intelligent depth camera for precision and real-time HD video transmissions. This dog follows a human around and even understands many gestures, just like a real dog. Unitree weighs approximately 12 kilograms with a payload of 5 kilograms. 1 to 2.5 hours of endurance is available with two protective modes. Wouldn't you love to play with this playful pop without all the mess? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Candeco Circuit Pen What can you get for $45.99? New sneakers, a new game, or this Candeco Circuit Pen? This Tokyo-based startup invented a pen that uses conductive silver ink to transmit electricity onto paper. If you place a battery and a set of LED lights on some glossy paper, you can draw a line in any shape you wish to connect them. This light would appear as silver ink conducting electricity between the LED and the battery. This pen allows you to design a circuit you choose, and you can create excellent results just using your imagination. The circuit pen can bring the miniature town to life, as illustrated by the Japanese infrastructure firm Kendeko. You can get this pen on Amazon and bring your creations to life. Sabre Hypersonic Space Plane This incredible space plane can soar to 4,000 miles per hour, over five times the speed of sound. This hypersonic plane can get to New York from London in only one hour. Yes, one hour. A plane that can jet across oceans at lightning speed and be ready for commercial travel as early as 2030. The UK Space Agency CEO is Mr. Graham Turnock. He announced recently that the UK would be working with Australia to create the first ever space bridge. These space bridges will cater to planes, rockets, and jets to transport passengers around the world. The Sabre has developed to power a plane to 4,000 miles per hour and is fueled by oxygen and hydrogen combined. I know I cannot wait to get on one of these space bridges. How about you? Let us know in the comments below. Giant Robot Gundam Here is the Giant Robot Gundam, the world's tallest robot ever. This bot is over 60 feet tall with impressive features such as rotating its massive torso and picking up and putting down its legs. Once the developers are finished, the Giant Robot will have an impressive 25 degrees of freedom when walking. Yes, you heard that correctly, it will be able to walk. This entire thing's weight is estimated to be around 25 tons, which is much lighter for a robot this size. The hands of Gundam are 6.5 feet from the fingertips to the wrists. Pretty impressive, don't you think? Z-Scooter Meet the Z-Scooter, inspired by the original design of Corradino de Asanio. The scooter is one of the first self-balancing scooters ever. This aesthetic vision could be the future of scooter design worldwide. While this scooter looks vintage, it has modern elements such as zero emissions. The Z-Scooter can be designed and customized to add different covers. The structure of the scooter is solid and can handle different situations and terrains. This is because the material used to make this vehicle is all high quality.
The scooter can be easily disassembled into two pieces, great for transportation and easy storage. This scooter's lithium battery is from Tesla Model S, which gives 50% more power than traditional scooters. You can learn to drive this scooter in minutes, as it is easy to understand, and the scooter itself can intuitively follow its rider's body movements. When we said this self-balancing vehicle was all-terrain, we were not kidding. This scooter can ride on grass, roads, urban pavements, and uneven surfaces. The max speed you will get from this vehicle is around 20 km per hour. Strand Beast Have you ever seen some creatures and wondered how did they come up with this idea? Our next feature is one of them. You may have noticed that beach animals work a bit differently than us. Most beach animals' bodies do not walk with a bump, primarily because of how the upper leg is angled compared to the lower leg. The hip joint will stay at the same height thanks to the oblique position, compensated by that of the lower legs. The strand beast on your screen has at least 36 legs, all connected to a crankshaft. The legs have multiple tripods. Behind the row of hind legs, there is a row of extra legs that imitate the hind legs with parallelograms. In the end, what you get are the higher legs and lower legs operate as hind legs, offering the same balance and removing bumps in their steps. As funny as it looks, this strand beast does far more than just walking. Somehow it was created to hover a little over the ground, not to get buried in the sand. Most beach animals are sand magnets that attract sand once the wind blows. Sailing in the air could serve as a survival play for this creation. However, we must admit that this strand beast is more like an enormous caterpillar enjoying the beachside's air and waves. PigeonBot This is so cool, and I think children will love it too. The PigeonBot is a biohybrid robot that flies. It combines a propeller, a human-made aircraft's tail, and a fuselage. Engineers and designers at Stanford University created the PigeonBots and even debuted it in the Science Robotics paper. While the bot's wings do not flap, the mechanical skeleton joints can be compared to that of a bird's wings. Bird's wings, however, are more complex, and its anatomical structure is much like the human arms. You can find features on the wings of a bird similar to five fingers and a human wrist. As you may identify on your screen, PigeonBot has a wrist and fingers as well, with 20 feathers on each wing. These features were gathered from pigeons called squab. If you are an aerospace engineer, you may join the others and say that it will not work well. But to their surprise, it turned out pretty good. The main disadvantage of this robot is that it needs constant maintenance and its feathers were easily ruffled. They need to be preened or smoothed into place by hand. Like a Go Pro Last on our list today are the four-legged robots known as Like a Go. Like a Go was initially designed as a research device. It has four legs, 12 joints, and 12 mighty motors. This robot can maintain its balance even after hard kicks due to its three-axis motion stabilization. There are various models of Like a Go, including one paying tribute to a space dog, Leica. Leica is used as a symbol that it is possible to push the boundaries of human possibilities. Leica Go Pro is excellent for research platforms and will hopefully be soon used for practice. This four-legged robot can walk on all terrains, remain stable during impact, and even climb hills. Go on a flat surface for up to four hours on a single charge. You can load this robot with up to 20 pounds of load with rubber below its four legs. Its maximum speed is 0.8 miles per second. It can be remotely controlled and works independently of an operator. Leica Go is also equipped with GPS, cameras, and different sensors. This 20-pound robot uses a lithium-ion battery. Let us know what you think of this robot dog in the comments below. We are at the end of another fantastic episode. It was great having you here. Have you seen anything that you liked? Thanks for watching. Which technology did you find the most impressive and why? 
Let me know in the comments section below. And if you're new here, subscribe to TTI's New Thinking. If you like this video, please give us a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. See you next time. Peace!